Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. In these videos what I do is I try and break down productivity tips, tools and techniques and try to deconstruct them to make them as easy as possible for you to choose your right path in getting things done. So in this kind of quick video what I'll be doing is I'll be chasing up something that a couple of the community members have mentioned uh, about Todoist um, and what they've seen on kind of my Todoist and how I do it. Um, and that they wanted answering. Um, and basically, it's being able, being able to add emoji um, on the web. And um, a lot of people kind of starting to throw emoji out there. And I've done a couple of articles about this. And because I think emoji are becoming quite relevant to the productivity space, making things more, I don't know, more fun, more interactive, um, and a bit more playful. So what I'm going to just show you in this session is how to use and add emoji into uh, your tasks and also project folders. So what you simply need to do is, um, obviously, I'm going to show you on Todoist. I think you can do it with a lot of other ones. I've tried it with AnyDo. I've tried it with Wunderlist Online. It works. Um, but what you simply need to do is go over to the Chrome Web Store. Um, and for those who don't have Chrome, I'm sure this is available on Firefox. Uh, that's why I specifically try to make this about Chrome. But type in emoji input. And what you'll get is you'll get a couple of options, but go for the emoji input by emoji stuff. And this is a Chrome extension. And basically, it looks like this up in the top right hand corner. And you can click on this anytime and you can scroll through all of the emoji you get on iPhone. Um, and it formats them to whatever you need. Um, so, you know, the, whatever uh, you're putting it in, uh, if you're putting it in and it appears on Android, it will format to Android, etc. with iPhone 2. So once you've installed this, uh, what you simply do is when you're creating a task, you know, it could be uh, feed the dog. <laughs> I always use feed the dog as an example. What you simply do is hit emoji and you can actually search in the emoji. And I'm going to choose dog here and it simply goes straight into here, um, straight into the task. But what it could do if I wanted to is uh, let's say I saw these two, I could make a little list, copy them over and do that too. Um, and that's for things that don't take it immediately. So if I type this in as a task, it will come up. Uh, and as, as you see, it's formatted to what it has here. But also, obviously, when you're on Android, it will look a lot different. So that's how you do it in tasks. And uh, as you can see here, I've done it with uh, someday maybe, you know, travel. Um, I, and you can add specific ones. So let's say if I added those two dogs there, they'd pop up there too. And that's really, really easy, right? It's really, really simple to add these uh, emoji as you go along. And the benefit to this is it will appear exactly the same on um, on your you know Android and iPhone. So that's an easy little hack to getting um, the kind of uh, the, the the availability of emoji. Um, I mean, th someone uh, emailed in and called Martin, and uh, thanks for emailing in, Martin. He suggested going to Emoji Emojipedia and uh, doing it there. But I kind of find this one really useful, especially when I'm doing social media all day and just click it and I can go into it and just, uh, I don't drag, but I simply, I create a, an emoji line so I could do this, you know, a long one and then actually copy them over uh, and have them there. So that's really, really cool. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching my videos. Um, I hope this one was useful. Feel free to check out any other videos I've done and let me know if you want me to cover anything else. Uh, my email is chesidalessio at gmail.com. You can find it in the description. Thank you very much, everyone. Make sure to have a great week and keep productive. Cheers.